Hello and welcome to LabVIEW Advantage. In this video, we'll discuss about how to make the user interface automatically resize whenever you are going to change the size of your front panel window. So let's start with a simple example. I'm going to include the web, web form graph and then I'll have two boolean controls. So this is basically for the uh, improving the user experience. Uh, let's say in the beginning I have the size of my window as this large. Now when I, as you can see, like when I uh, make, made the front panel uh, fully screen, the size of the uh, graph as well as the buttons remain the same. Uh, this is not actually very good in terms of the user experience because you have got like a lots of empty spaces. Now what we're going to do is, I'm going to uh, change the attribute of my front panel uh, so that whenever I'm going to change the size of the front panel, the uh, user interface, for example, in this case, two Boolean buttons as well as the waveform graph are going to resize according to the size of my front panel. So to achieve that, to make use of the empty space, right click on the bottom hand corner, pane resizing, and then if you select the first option, the size of the controls and then the graph is going to expand or shrink based on the size of my front panel window. But the problem is as the front panel becomes too small, the buttons is going to overlap. And as you can see, when I expand it back, my user interface has been uh, you know distorted uh, to avoid that i'm going to use like undo and then we have came into the uh, original condition so one of the way is to lock the buttons okay now as you can see like uh, i don't have the options enabled but because of that reason as you can see only the graph is now expanding or shrinking based on the diagram but this is going to be a quick fix, but this is not actually highly useful because it's still like a, you are wasting a lot of spaces. To make use of the best practice, I'm going to unlock that one. So if you right click inside the containers, you'll see something called vertical splitter bar. So what it does is it separates your user interface components into two different parts. So at the moment, I got like a two boolean controls into the left hand side, and I don't actually want uh, their size to be changed whenever I'm going to expand or reduce the size of my front panel. Uh, next, I'm going to expand the size of my graph so that like uh, it is going to take the entire space. Now, what I'm going to do is okay, the option is correct. Now what I'm going to do is, is once I save it, and as you can see, whenever I increase, the button size remains the same, only the graph is going to increase. So this is the best way to make sure the components in your user interface are not going to be distorted whenever you change the size of your front panel. I hope you like this video. Please like, share, and comment on this video, and please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for future Labby videos.